Salutations upon all points. Do what thou wilt shall be the whole of the law. Fucking hell of a month, huh, guys? Hell, hell of a month. So, to live on the first in Pittsburgh during the new moon. And then we saw Tool Live in Cleveland during the Vernal Equinox full moon of this month. So, um, I've been kind of focused on that whole party. <laughs> More than, let's say, some other things that might be going on. I don't know what you guys have been talking about. Or worrying about. But. It reminds me a lot of. The first time I saw a tool. It was like, uh, during the Aliens tour. Whatever people call it now. Uh, and that was like right after, oh, you know, 9-11 and all, this was like 2001, 2000, I forget now, it was a little forever ago, but it, I'm pretty sure Manon said a similar thing where he was like, uh, whatever's going on out there, leave it out there, I don't know, it's having flashbacks. During <laughs> uh, a, a ceremony. So, oh man. Ah, uh, new video, new tool video. There's a new tool video. Did you guys know that? I don't know if you've heard. There's this new tool video. It's uh, it's just to a new version of an old song, so you probably never really like whatever too into it. <laughs> uh, I know I talk about the Gnostic creation story a lot. Um, uh, and try to bring everything back to the tree and evolution of spirit our body is light kind of shit <laughs> but holy fucking shit is that video perfect uh, as in a creation mythos uh, the light on the waters and then the should we just I mean would they take me Okay, here's the thing. I did a review of Sweat. I the first thing off of Opia, and it's the only video in my whole catalog besides things from Pink Floyd, who apparently block things uh, ferociously and without quarter. Uh, <laughs> besides anything that has the wall in it, the, the, the only video that I've made is a review I tried to do legit I was kind of being jokey but legit review <laughs> I had a script at least but uh this fucking guy blocks me this guy uh okay if you didn't know, you can watch the first three minutes on Tool, and then there's this. Then you gotta do Strange Magic after that. I don't know what to tell you. But what we're gonna do. Oh. Angelica. That, that creature halfway. That creature. Excuse me. Uh, Angelica. 
is what I, I was calling them for a long time because I I only ever sold the licking part live. Well, I saw that shit live a couple of times. And once. And then the video. How do I. Re. Re. Scratch that. Reverse it. Okay. Okay. Dude. Hey, don't get so excited. I don't, I don't get there. You know, you just, you just you gotta relax. Everybody just gotta relax. <laughs> you gotta relax. Everybody just gotta relax. Because I want to see if it is this as perfect as I think. Because the I, this, the story is so Fia falls from the Pleroma. Her light casts. And she continues to multiply. Like uh, emanations of God multiply continually within the Pleroma. Which is the fullness. It is God within God expanding. But each emanation is like an aeon or whatever they all have a name like uh they are titles like how the archons are principalities and, and this type of stuff it's the same thing except for there before the fall all ideas principles and points in time and space all aligned and work together and were as one. The fullness, the pleroma is God as one, even divided. Like uh Christ is technically a uh, member of the pleroma. So there's the light. Sophia, whatever you want to call it, it's the music playing in this case. Which, okay, here's another thing. The <laughs> There's a thing I read a long time ago. I think it was in Samuel on lower stuff that angels copulate or make love with the larynx, which is uh, like, so they sing. You know, they sing together, and that they, that's them making love. So, choirs of angels are orgies of angels. Oh, that's why they sweat fire. That's not why they sweat fire, but they do sweat fire. And that's what pours down into the fires of hell, where people deny whatever, whatever, and these desires are burned out. Or however you look at <laughs> Tartarus. Uh, it's from sweat from orgying angels. Choices always were a problem for you. Now, when it says you there, that thing moves. That's the first time it moves on the waters because it hears something talking about it, which is just like Yaldabaoth hearing Sophia say his name. And he says, I am that I am. And from that point, he takes that knowledge, the light. He uses the energy of the light and the name given to build the universe. This tree right here, he, this pattern is the pattern from above. It's cast down onto it, and he's able to use it to build a whole universe, which is a body. A body is a universe so what we're seeing here is a universe evolving 
the same way as we're seeing an entity evolving. Uh, as above, so below. He's like, uh, you got to think big creation and small creation, macrocosm, microcosm. The same things are archetypal. The images are the same. The archetypal patterns are the same. Right? Progeny recapitulates. What's that thing that Alex Gray says? Progeny. It's whenever in the womb the fetus goes through all of evolution, basically. I can't think of the, the phrase right now. So there he sees the light and is determined to get to it. Okay. See, these things are on the edge. I'm still working on that. But one thing that came to mind is that it, they're already there, right? Like, as much as he is doing the evolution, there's already things built there, like edifices. They, they almost look like tombstones, like pyramids, tombs. But it's also like uh, previous things that came before him all did this similar thing and tried to leave a mark behind but what it also is happening is it leaves open a path like on either side so like it's also guiding him to the light So, there's the, the, another thing Alex Gray says when in the fetus and uh, makes a particular struggle, uh, uh, a difficult mood, a difficult move, uh, a wunderkiff or whatever he says. That's this. That's that. See how it lifts its head up from it's already up, but then it pulls its head up. Wunderkiff. So, it's like it turning. It's whenever you are. Mm. No, no, not the same as an animal. He he's reaching an ange, angelic stage. What in his speed so. so the the thing is okay. The thing about Yal the Both is once he hears his name, once he hears the song, he thinks he's singing the song. So he thinks he's he's still using this song, the light. That's what the light is in this, is the song. He's still using the song to evolve. So what we're seeing here is a type of evolution that he's using, that he's finding in the song. It is a graph, from what I can tell. I don't remember... One two three one two one two three one two one two three one two three one two. That's a fucking. That is a beat. These are beats in in the music of the scale. These dots are beats. One two three one two one two three one two three one two one two three one two. That's how that's how Danny drums. That's how they play their guitar. They have beats like that. And it alters him. Yeah, rape is such a heavy word. But okay, here's the thing. You're a creature waiting to procreate for how 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 long? You need to literally wait for something else to evolve to get to you before you can even procreate. So you are waiting forever <laughs> to fuck something. And when something finally comes along, uh, I, I guess even uh, Elohim get carried away. This is why I call it Angelica, though. Uh, the Angel, as in a name. 
Well, not just angel liquor, but that's kind of what I thought. <laughs> Angelica. So he reaches out and touches it. No, no longer just using what he hears. Uh, there is like he licks it. Gonna lick it a little bit. And with that, see, did you sort of see what that was? How it had that, that ball on it? That is like a, like at the end, when they have the neurons that touch each other, that are the neurons. Yeah. And they connect with electrical whatever. That's kind of what that looks like, except for he's unable to maintain connection. As in, he's not evolved enough. But immediately, he is more evolved having touched it. But now this thing, I don't know if he changes it by touching it. Or if it's just now more aware of him. Because he reaches the stage that he can touch it. And, and because he touches it, I think... Think it grabs him there. I know that we see a different thing, but eventually in evolution, in our evolution, we procreate with one another, right? So maybe that's the same way with uh, the universe here that we're seeing the body, these bodies of light. Maybe they acquire lesser bodies because there's a reason to believe that at the end. Like, think schism, the Elohim. At the end of that is the dual being. Like Elohim is male, female, um, pronoun, suffix, whatever in the Jewish thing of God. So it is a male, female, simultaneous. Some people think that it's just talking about a race of human like beings that are god and they have different titles like yahweh and jehovah and and the reason why you pick the reason why jehovah makes a deal with the jews and says you're my chosen people worship no one but me right is because he they are forming a relationship together, like boyfriend girlfriend type shit. <laughs> Dig, kitty, like a marriage, and you don't cheat on your hubby, right? Of course, there's other women or men out there, but you don't go worship them, right? You don't go have sex with them. That's what this is. It's exactly what this is all about is that you make a deal with God that your body is theirs this is why the Pentecostal light lighting the descending of the flame spirit is fire you have to be an open vessel see how this is like a cup here this widens and widens and widens out as this goes up. And that's a turns into a chalice, basically. Uh, because you are to receive the influx of what falls from above. Okay? If you're not willing to do that, it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt that's the rape you part if you're you gotta be willing you can't rape the willing right be be willing or you're gonna be hurt so here there's this alternating perception thing which uh, i've been this is what makes me think about there's two things because if that thing came out of the waters below this is showing that there's waters above where these, this, these things of light hover between, betwixt the air itself.
So you have this plane of existence on the bottom. You have a plane of existence above. And it, they're both lined with this old Freemasonry just left behind. But there are, there's this... <laughs> There's something out there, man. <laughs> and it wants, uh, it wants you. Did you know that? Who do you serve? You, you have all this cho choice in the world. See, here's the thing. Like, you can do whatever you want. You can say nothing means anything. Or you can choose a guru or a belief system or a magic system or a teacher and listen to them. You can choose to learn from a master and accept that you don't know everything. <gasps> I know it's crazy in these wild times, but that's the, the big joke is that, yeah, eventually you do have to choose somebody to follow if you want to get the fuck out of your own head like you're if you're lost you can't help yourself out <laughs> you can't find the way you're not you're, you're not you're not the way man you're not it I'm sorry it's inside you but if you can't accept that you need somebody to show it to you show you exactly what you have inside you by filling you with fire. And then you'll feel it. And you'll know exactly what you are. When something devours you. Or if you give in to it. See, okay. Okay. <laughs> See, that was... The, the whole Elohim that I was getting at. But now there's this this new thing. A new one. Alone. And he's very much different than the other one. And there's like something inside it though. Like, ah, that's weird. That's like the an angelic or tongue thing. <laughs> like the serpent inside. Okay. This is like <laughs> you are broken now, but faith can heal you. Just do everything I tell you to do. Okay, the now the spidey. The spider and the got his little guy in the web. I wasn't ready. I didn't seem ready. See, this also is he getting tossed around from one to another? Like, is he because he didn't choose one, or that's just a just one right now, dude? Because look. Did you get okay? That that what is exactly what if you take a shitload of acid and listen to the tool and uh yeah that's what that's what you look like <laughs> that's what I look like I, I I know for a fact I I have felt that way that my fucking muscles and shit bend all weird shaking like for some reason I was at Reggie's one night just. Uh, shaking like crazy. I, uh... Anyway, the, your brain on tool. See how there's a couple of them. I think they're throwing them around. I think it's like. But they're the ones that were making out. Okay. We don't have to get the face. It's hard to get the face. You remember the schism thing where he, there are two of them together and they have a couple arms. Well, wow. Well, 
there are arms going way up here okay and this is right here is uh uh the light <laughs> but oh man okay so how is it of is it acquiring vessels every time it grows right so it's been growing up up and 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 up like each circle is that actually going up further it's just an easier way to whatever uh okay so the thing waits for things to evolve has these little guys uh, like children those things have children that are like the thing and <laughs> i don't know when it when you reach a far enough evolution you can boy you're boy you're just lucky enough to get um godhead imperium okay cuz cuz I got a little deep throat action that was cute well okay okay so there it's like instant regret that that's the face of regret right <sighs> which is why you need to be all in you know there's, there's no reason you should okay it's your brain on tool this is your brain on tool remember that that that's what this is this is but also okay see how the eyes are feeding the eye it's your man this is this video is just great your your penile gland gland and your two eyes God, Godhead, Godhead, do you see, you must let go of what you think you are to obtain Godhead. And, uh, man and it is terrifying it's like if you've ever smoked DMT there's like that veil of patterns oh look at that look at that still Eyeballs, man. <laughs> Eyeballs, your balls. My balls. Okay. This is what I was talking about the synapses or something earlier. Okay. So this is the that bottom that place with all the little old with the path. But it's also bending in on itself. Like, there seems to be paths going every which, every which way. Like, multi-dimensional to, towards that center. But that's just, like, whoa. That's just the um, tendrils. Okay. Let's fucking look at... One, two, so that connects up. 
Does that look like a guy meditating at the bottom there? Either way. That's what I was talking about, the synapse. Sorry, I was counting. I just fucked it up. There's a big sphere, sphere there with a bunch of fiery. Okay, now see how another one's growing out of that. Okay, so one, two, three. See how that's up? It's up into a new place now. Uh, like the like a, like, a, like, a, like a lotus growing through a bunch of shit. It blooms above. I can see it is planted. Its flower blooms above. above. Which is that? Is that its head? Oh. No, I don't even know. Like there. Right there. Right there. See it. See it. <laughs> oh, shit. There, there it is. So, um, mm. so transcendental being at the end. <gasps> Did you see that? Hey, no, not that. It was like the. It was like the thing from 10,000 Days. 